good morning students <coughs> in this lecture <coughs> we will discuss uh, advantages of jigs and fixtures uh, before uh, talking about advantages uh, of jigs and fixture we have to know something about uh, jigs and fixtures uh, i have told already told you in my previous lectures that uh, jigs holds and uh, positions the work and uh, locates or guides uh, the cutting tool uh, with respect to workpiece and uh, mostly a jig is not fixed to the machine table and uh, uh, if we will compare the jig to the fixture it is lighter in construction and uh, jigs uh, are used on uh, drilling and uh, rimming tapping and counter boring operations and uh, if we uh, are talking about the fixture uh, fixture only holds and uh, positions the work but uh, uh, does not guide or locate the cutting tool and uh, a fixture is bolted or clamped to the machine table and uh, it is uh, heavy in construction if you will if you will compare it from <coughs> jig and uh, fixtures are uh, used for uh, milling grinding shaping planning or boring and uh, also in welding operations and uh, uh, the jig of uh, depend uh, on uh, the dimensions of the part and it is designed to hold and uh, small jigs are uh, usually moved by hand uh, on the drill press table until the guide or uh, drill bushings and uh, the, is directly under the drill and the rotating drill is guided through uh, bushing into the work by using a lever on the press so if uh, we are uh, consider uh, some points uh, about uh, fixture then you can say that uh, the device used for uh, a device is a, a work holding device and that is bolted or otherwise fastened to the machine and a fixture do not provide uh, for for the guiding of processing tool instead the tool is moved to the point of operation as in the case of radial drill or the table is moved under the processing tool as uh, in milling machine so uh, if you are uh, going to use uh, a fixture in milling machine that you can uh, it is known as uh, milling fixture so according to the use uh, we can define the name of the fixture and uh, now <coughs> we will discuss uh, advantages of jigs and fixtures uh, before uh, talking about uh, the advantages of a fixture uh, and jigs i will uh, tell you uh, some summary about uh, fixtures and jigs for example uh, if uh, someone ask you a question that uh, the device uh, in which uh, a component is held and located for a specific operation in such a way that it will guide one or more cutting tools uh, during uh, machining so is known as you know uh, this is a, a simple question uh, i will repeat my question again if uh, someone ask you a device in which a component is held and located for a specific operation in such a way that it will guide one or more cutting tools during machining process is known as uh, uh, if you have uh, four options uh, first one is a jig and second one is the gauge and third one is the fixture and uh, fourth one option is the template so uh, you have to write uh, tick right answer is jig so these are the some questions that uh, someone will ask you when uh, we are uh, he is talking about the uh, 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 jigs and the fixtures another important question will come in front of you that uh, the production tooling equipment uh, which locates and holds the component for a, a specific operation but it is not guide the cutting tool is known as uh, here is the uh, some uh, options are given and first one is the template and second one is the gauge and third one is the fixture fourth one is the jig so uh, the, uh, uh, if you know the answer you can uh, write your answer in ch uh, chat box and uh, this is the right answer is fixture because uh, we have uh, mentioned here that it does not guide the cutting tool it will be located and hold the uh, cutting tool so 
now uh, i will tell you something about uh, the advantages of jigs and fixtures and jigs and fixtures are uh, useful in the following ways uh, eliminates the uh, laborious making out of each workpiece before machining and hence eliminate costly setup required so uh, in it, it help to increase machining accuracy uh, it it is clear that uh, you know very well if you know about the jig and fixture so you can easily say that it help to increase the machining accuracy because uh, it, it can uh, eliminate all disturbing forces uh, during the cutting or machining operations clear and ensures automatic location of the workpiece because uh, if we are going to perform any type of operation uh, any type of operation at a different type of the workpiece so we have to ensure we have to ensure that uh, uh, there is a uh, no motion take place in uh, all directions uh, so uh, it help to uh, locate the workpiece completely and increase the production rate definitely uh, we can say that uh, it help to increase the production rate uh, production uh, uh, reduces the cost of production this is the another factor if you will use jigs and fixture and then these uh, help to uh, reduces the cost of production and increase the production rate yani adhik se adhik matra mein ma hamara product banega aur cost uski kam rahegi to mass production bhi mein hum use kar sakte hain save operational labors labors you know जो लेबर कॉस्ट थी उसको भी सेव कर सकते हैं एंड यूज ऑफ लेस स्किल्ड लेबर पॉसिबल्स अगर आप चाहते हैं कि हमारा जो लेबर है वो स्किल्ड नहीं है तो इट कैन यूज लेस स्किल्ड लेबर पॉसिबल एंड इनक्रीज द वर्सेटिलिटी ऑफ मशीनिंग एंड अनदर पॉइंट यू कैन राइट Uh, either fully or partially automates the machine tools and uh, uh, increase the production capacity that i have told you and handling the time is uh, also greatly and reduced due to quick setting and locating of the workpiece and the speed feed depth of cut and machining can be increased uh, due to high clamping rigidity and of jigs and fixtures enable the production Uh, of identical parts which are interchangeable the facilitates the assembles operations and reduces reduces expenditures uh, this is another important point that is not mentioned here uh, reduces expenditures involved in quality control and facilitators assembly and also have future upkeep due to uh, uh, uniformity of manufacturing tolerances and uh, Uh, this is no doubt uh, jigs and fixture have to improve safety at work you have to keep uh, this point in your mind that uh, how to uh, jigs and fixture improve safety at work hence uh, lowering rate of accidents so it help to reduce the uh, accidents uh, during the machining operations uh, now uh, we will discuss the applications of uh, jigs and fixture but uh, Uh, before discussing the application for jig and fixture i i want to discuss to you economics of jigs and fixtures jigs and fixtures are used to increase production and reduces cost through the savings in a labor cost and other overheads it is uh, important to consider whether jigs or fixtures should be made uh, for a given job as well as the amount of money that can be spent on, uh, uh, on them even where the number of pieces to be made may not uh, seem to reduce the cost of a jig the saving in the time is assembly as well as the proper functioning of the machine itself uh, may be uh, uh, it is necessary and make a, a jig uh, to secure duplication of parts and uh, of machine performance in case of uh, a limited uh, number of pieces uh, to be made its importance and may be considered in comparison to the growing appreciation uh, of the jig 
boring machine and uh, of the boring machines uh, which have been designed uh, to permit the accurate location and boring of all and uh, the cost and advantage uh, of different methods must be balanced against one another where many jigs or fixtures are to be made a jig boring machine of some sort will prove to be uh, a paying investment it will also save the cost of many jigs where only a few pieces of a kind are to be made after deciding the construction of a jig the next step is to the cost of the jig which is of great concern the cost of the jig should not overshadow the shavings to be made every time it is used some economy may be achieved by using standardized parts therefore before starting the design and construction of the equipment its economic analysis must be worked out and uh, two very important uh, items to be considered are the initial investment and the production volume aapne initial initial investment kitna kiya hai how much uh, uh, money have you spent uh, spent and uh, uh, production volume uh, what, what type of the production is now going on uh, mass production batch production project based production and it is a simple reason that if items uh, to be produced are a few agar hamare items jo hain wo bahut kam matra mein produce ho rahe hain a large investment will not be justified so uh, definitely uh, economic taur par agar hum baat karte hain तो लार्ज इन्वेस्टमेंट की कोई हमारी इतनी आवश्यकता नहीं होती इट इज नॉट नेसेसरी टू जस्टिफाइड ए लॉट ऑफ इन्वेस्टमेंट इन और जिक्स एंड फिक्सर्स सेटअप सो इफ इफ वी टॉक अबाउट सम कंक्लूजन सो वी कैन से दैट जिक्स एंड फिक्सर्स आर डिवाइस यूज टू लोकेट एंड ऑल द वर्क एंड दैट इज टू बी मशीन ए जिक इज अ गाइडिंग डिवाइस एंड ए फिक्सर इज अ holding device this is the totally conclusion you have keep in your mind and now uh, we will discuss <coughs> some applications for jigs and fixtures application applications of jigs are uh, drilling reaming tapping that uh, i have told you in my previous lecture and today's lecture that uh, jigs is used for drilling operations reaming operations tapping if you want to create internal threads then the operation is known as a uh, tapping and another application of fixtures are milling milling machines mein aap uh, fixtures ko use kar sakte hain grinding machine ho gaya hamara planing hota hai trending operations mein you can use of use of fixture and in shaping machines uh, shaping machine mein aap uh, use kar sakte hain fixtures ko so these are the basic applications of jigs and fixtures that uh, are uh, mentioned here now <clears throat> before uh, ending this uh, lecture i want to ask you uh, some questions that will uh, uh, come in uh, competitive exams for example uh, i have discussed you two questions and uh, i now i will tell you something about uh, uh, the simplest type of uh, jig out of the following is if question will come in front of you that the simplest type of jig out of the following if the uh, options are first one is the leaf jig and uh, second one is the plate jig and third one is the uh, template jig and box jig so what is your right answer you know uh, you have to keep in your mind what is jig what is fixture and what is the types of jig and what is the uh, types of the fixture applications advantages disadvantages principles then you will uh, Uh, okay, you can uh, easily give the answer of uh, this question. So uh, the most simplest jig is, is the template jig. You know, I have told you in uh, in my previous lecture that template jig is a very simplest form of the jig. And another question uh, will you see in your competitive exam that the importance property to be considered in the selection of the suitable material for manufacture of a locating pins used in jigs. and fixtures construction is agar aap uh, uh, selection kar rahe hain material ka to kis type ka material aapko pin ka select karna hoga jo jigs aur fixture ki construction mein use hoti hain for if uh, options are uh, shear strength it have shear strength and elasticity tensile strength and wear resistance so uh, here are, here is the four options that you can 
choose your right answers and the sheer wear resistance because if you are using uh, jigs and fixtures and we are uh, in machining operations so we know that uh, there are lot of cutting forces uh, and uh, applied on the fixtures and jigs so uh, material we are going to select for the pins using jigs and fixtures so it it has the uh, uh, wear resistance so these are the some questions that i told you and uh, discussed with you and uh, thank you uh, very